I mean, this no. is wild. <laughs> Legit, Paris. <laughs> Paris Hilton like, used your audio. What? That's, that is really crazy, truly. Hey, it's your girl, Emily Curl with iHeartRadio, and today we're hanging out with Lily of Beach Bunny. Lily, how are you? Thank you for being here. Hi, thanks for having me. <laughs> now, we have to talk about your song, Cloud9, because it absolutely blew up on TikTok. So we actually have a few TikToks we want to show you. We pulled some of our favorites using the sound. Before we get into that, tell me a little bit about this song. When did you first discover that it was going so viral? I think people on Twitter were uh, tagging me in TikTok clips, being like, oh, people are using this with their partners. And then I checked and I was like, whoa, there's like 40,000 videos. What? How did I miss this? <laughs> now, when did you first join TikTok? I used to be a little bit skeptical of the TikTok, but then I think over the pandemic, you run out of things to do. So I ended up downloading it and I was like, oh, this is pretty awesome. And even seeing all the videos people using your sound, did you have a few favorites that you watched? There was one um, person that used it to promote their grandpa's business that was going out of business. Um, it was like a sushi restaurant. And then, yeah, I guess the restaurant got saved from everybody that was viewing the TikTok and like donating, which is oh crazy. Oh my God. Yeah. TikTok's magical in that way. I agree. I agree. Well, we have a few others that we want to show you that we've pulled. So we just want you to react to them. You might have seen them before, but we're going to throw <laughs> a few on screen. So if we want to go ahead and put up that first TikTok. They call me pretty. I feel like somebody. Oh my God. That was so sweet. <laughs> That was like an angel. <laughs> right? Now, also these lyrics are obviously emotional. Tell me a little bit about the inspiration behind the song. It's really cool how, how everyone's made it their own on the app. Because I think the original song was very much like, it, it was a love song, but it was sort of, it was right before a breakup. So I saw it coming. It was one of those things. It was almost like like a please don't break up with me song. But now I think it's been reclaimed as like a like a true love song, which is awesome. And and also now that I have like a new partner and stuff like that, it's it's awesome uh, that like I feel like I can reclaim it too and like, you know, picture them when I sing it and everything. I love that. All right, let's show you another one that we pulled. He calls me pretty. Everyone is so talented. <laughs> so talented. It's honestly insane. Like you could hear the passion. <laughs> wow. What does it feel like for you seeing other people so beautifully sing the words that you wrote, your lyrics? It's honestly very surreal, especially if I'm not on like the band TikTok. I'm just on my personal scrolling, you know, being anonymous. And I and I run across one of those. I'm like, whoa, like this isn't just my algorithm from Beach Bunny. Like people really are singing this song. It's crazy. Have you got to play the song live yet? Uh, yes, yeah. It's been awesome, but I feel like we haven't been able to play it live since it blew up. So it was fun playing it, you know, on tour and everything, but like there hasn't been an opportunity to see everyone's real time reactions. Um, okay, we have a few more for you. Let's throw up our next one on screen. When he loves me, I feel like I'm burning. Lily, the queen herself, used your audio. <laughs> Insane. I have not seen this one. You haven't? I mean, this no. is wild. Legit, Paris. I'm Paris like... Hilton used your audio. What? That's, that is really crazy, truly. Wow. That's hot. Wow. I mean, that's it was so really hot. cute. It's so hot. <laughs> she looks great. Right? She's so, she looks so in love. How does that feel for you to see that? Well, I think it took a few clips for me to process that. It was like, wow, that, that girl really looks like Paris Hilton. And then she did the hair flip. I was like, oh my God, <laughs> what? No, it's awesome. Uh, yeah, I don't know. There's been a few people, like big names on TikTok that have used it too. And it's, it's always surreal. Like, it's crazy, truly. So we have people singing your covers. <laughs> we have Paris Hilton. And now we have a few <laughs> more creative ones that we wanted to show you. So let's throw our okay. next one up on screen. Wait, now is this a projection or is this real? I think it's a projection. That's so cool. What? Wow. I need to get that. <laughs> Whatever that is, I need to get it. Of all the window views, which one spoke to you the most? You know, I'm a city girl. I think I like the skyscraper setting the most with the sunset. All right, let's show you another one of the creative TikToks. Oh, when he loves me, I feel like 
Ooh. Do we see the final thing? <laughs> we I have the final so. thing. <laughs> we just got a little preview. Now, do you ever get sick of hearing your song over and over? Or are you still like, are you still in the positive phase of it? <laughs> it, it depends on the day. <laughs> okay, honest. okay. So sometimes you have to put TikTok down and you're like, I need a break from hearing this on repeat. Totally. I think especially because it's just that little sound bite. I'm like, oh my God, my voice is getting annoying. <laughs> I think we have another one. Let's start up on screen. Oh my God, I need this for my birthday. Me too. <laughs> wow, that is so cool. Do you like to cook? I do like to cook. I need to get better at baking, but I love all this like, yeah, the cake art stuff is so cool how they do that, wow. Okay, let's throw up our next one. What? So fast. I was like, is this a transition? No, I actually think he jumps on that skateboard. Yes, I see it now. Oh wow, the timing of that. I would be on my butt. That would never work out. Do you skateboard at all? I like to rollerblade, but skateboarding, Ooh. not my strong sort. <laughs> Have you recorded TikTok of you rollerblading to your song? I feel like the internet needs that. <laughs> well, I'll work on it. <laughs> I need to learn a trick. Um, okay, let's throw the next one up on screen. But when he loves me, I feel like I'm boating when he calls me. That was adorable. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was really cute. So like genuine too. How do you feel watching something back like this? Literally people being in love to your song. It's amazing. Oh, it's so cute. I'm 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 very happy for this. I feel like the last time we had a song flow up on TikTok, it was about um like body issues. So this mm. is such like a it's nice to see really positive videos because I think the other one was a little more sad. <laughs> Yeah, oh, definitely. You said you're in a relationship now. How would you describe your relationship? And did you make a video with this song for yours? <laughs> yeah, I made like a brief little, a little clip. But yeah, no, it's awesome. So in love, feeling all the good vibes. I can't wait till there's a show so I can like spot him in the crowd and be like, this one's for you. <laughs> I can always imagine that, that has to be a magical moment, especially for an artist. Yeah, no, they're, they're so awesome. And like, I feel like this is also my first like, very positive, healthy relationship. <laughs> so it feels really nice. That, like this came in sync with this trend blowing up. I'm like, wow, it feels like, like my heart is just uh, in sync with the universe or something. <laughs> Has this inspired you to write more music in line with being in love? Oh, definitely. Yeah, new, new album. We'll be hearing some more love songs for sure. <laughs> oh, I cannot wait for that. <laughs> um, okay, we have a few more for you. Oh God, I love it already. I know. <laughs> Me, I feel like I'm gone. That was the best one. <laughs> this this one takes the cake. I hope that every single one of these pups is like like in a new home right now, just living their best life. <laughs> Are you a dog person? Oh yeah, I would love to have a dog one day. I think I'm waiting till like touring simmers down and things like that. Let's pull up the next one. Hi, it's Beach Bunny. Oh, it's me. <laughs> I made a new version of Cloud9. It uses he or him, she or her, and they them pronouns. So you remade this song with inclusive pronouns, which is amazing. What made you want to do something like that? It was a combination of like TikTok, kind of almost like calling for it, and then finding like the perfect people to collab with on it. I feel like um, I was seeing a lot of covers with alternative pronouns and things like that, and it just, it felt right. And um, yeah, and my boyfriend like uses they and he, so I was like, you know what, this is great. It's checking all the boxes. Definitely, do you think you'll do that with more of your music in the future? Yeah, maybe. I think I'm just trying to be more self-aware that like, maybe just like not avoiding pronouns, but making songs just more like people can apply them to any situation they're in. Even though this one was great that we could use all three. Uh, I think just sometimes it's easier to be like, like instead of using a pronoun, be like you or my love or whatever, <laughs> you know. And now you mentioned new music coming out soon. What can you tell us about the new album? Yeah, it'll be a bit more songs than Honeymoon and it's kind of like retro space themed aesthetically. Yeah, lots of love songs. I'm really proud of the lyrics on the upcoming stuff. I think we get into more topics, so I'm excited. Ooh, what topics are you going to touch on? I think it's like a mix between like, like there are a couple like breakup -y songs, but there's definitely a lot of love songs, a lot of like just inner reflection, mental health. It's a wider variety, I think. Lily, thank you so much for being here. It's so great chatting with you and for going through all those TikToks. So amazing thank to you. see people using your music. And hopefully next time we see you, we'll be in real life at our iHeart studio. 
Oh yeah, I cannot wait. Thank you so much for having me. Of course. Thanks so much for watching our TikTok roundup with Lily from Beach Bunny. Make sure you stream their new song, Cloud9, out now, and we'll see you next time. Hey guys, thanks so much for watching. Did you like that video? You can check out more over here. And don't forget to subscribe to iHeart right here. And if you're already a longtime fan, make sure you ring the bell down below so you don't miss a single video. Bye guys.